Welcome everybody to another sharing session. Today let's talk about near miss reporting. What is the definition of near miss incident? A near miss is an unplanned event that did not result in any injury, illness or damage, but had the potential to do so. Occurrences that can be near misses. Unsafe conditions, unsafe behavior, minor incidents or injuries with potential to be more serious. Events where injury could have occurred but didn't, and events with property damage. Human error is commonly an initiating event. However, a faulty process or system allows or compounds the situation, and should be the focus of improvement. Figure 1 shows an accident pyramid adapted from Heinrich's study of workplace accidents. For every accident that results in a major injury, there would be 29 accidents with minor injuries, and 300 near misses. How do we encourage near miss reporting? Employees' participation is vital for near miss reporting to succeed. Therefore, we need to educate them on why near miss reporting is necessary. Employees should also understand that they play a crucial role in the process of reporting. No blame culture. Reassure your employees that the information being collected will be used to learn and improve not to blame or punish. You can consider anonymous reporting. Employees would be more comfortable with sharing information when their identities are kept confidential. Empower employees. Employees at all levels should be empowered to spot and fix hazards at their own discretion before near misses escalate into more severe consequences. Usually employees hesitate to make immediate rectification because they are not sure if it is their responsibility to do so. Communication Communication is key in promoting near misreporting among employees. Regular and consistent communication will help to sustain the interest to report. Combining open communication with no blame policy will let employees feel that their suggestions are valued. Create a reporting culture. You should act to identify and control hazards, reduce risk and prevent harmful incidents. The senior management can begin by communicating the policy to all employees. The support from managers and supervisors is vital as they work closely with the workers. Feedback. Feedback motivates employees to do near miss reporting as they can see that their suggestions are valued and help shape their workplace. In the event that more time is needed to rectify the condition, feedback will also reassure employees that their contributions are not being overlooked. And lastly, promoting incentives. One possible method to encourage near miss reporting is to offer incentives to employees. Example of a good incentive is to recognize the participation of employees in reporting of hazards. When implemented correctly, near miss reporting can improve your ability to identify gaps in your safety system before an injury or property damage occurs. Thank you for your kind attention.